Habitat for Humanity is transforming lives by bringing people together to build homes, communities, and hope. Here to tell us more about what they do and their upcoming event is Lane Himmelman. Hi, Lane. Thanks Hi. for being here. Thanks so much for having me. Well, first off, tell me about this exciting event you guys have coming up. Sure. So what we do at Habitat for Humanity is we bring people together to build and repair homes for low-income families, seniors, veterans, and revitalized neighborhoods. And one night a year, we get fancy. <laughs> fancy. <laughs> and, uh, and we bring people together to raise critical needed support um, to help make those projects possible. So our big gala event is coming up this Saturday at Memorial Auditorium. We'll be bringing over 400 people um, to Memorial to help raise funds for Habitat with a live auction and a dinner. It's pretty incredible. We're going to have Fizz, Sacramento's only <laughs> champagne bar. They'll be supplying all of the Fizz and then uh, local wine vendors like Silt and Bogle will be also great. bringing in some really great beverages for people to enjoy. Well, you mentioned fancy and you were telling me how you're dressing up for this. So this is something everybody gets gussied up. It's a really formal event. It is. I mean, typically on the Habitat site, we are in the trenches, sleeves rolled up, but this night is completely black tie. So you cannot underdress. Um, mm -hmm. Very, very nice. <laughs> And you mentioned um, there's going to be some like, auctions, raffles. What are some of the um, items that are going to be raffled? We do. So we do a very high-end live auction. And those experiences range from, you know, we have trips to Mexico. Ooh. We have a, a luxury Mendocino tree house that was featured in the New York Times. It actually wow. has a beautiful tree that's growing inside of this villa. The Sacramento Police Department has donated a day on their tactical training course where, uh, and you also get a helicopter helicopter ride. Wow. <laughs> we have an anchor dinner where you get the opportunity to have a really nice dinner at Paragary's restaurant. And there are anchor representatives from ABC 10, Fox 40, Good Day Sacramento, and KCRA 3. And also an opportunity to come and speak with you here on this show right. and at Good Day. Awesome. Um, so just a really wide uh, um, opportunity for- Wow, sounds like a lot of different items depending on what you might fancy. Yes. Um, so where do all the proceeds from this event go? So all of the support goes to fund Habitat for Humanity of Greater Sacramento projects. So um, homes for low-income families that will be built with 500 hours from the family themselves and hundreds of volunteers then the families will purchase those homes for a 30-year mortgage as well as uh, repair projects for low-income homeowners seniors and veterans so that they can stay in their homes and avoid displacement during this challenging housing crisis and neighborhood revitalization projects and we're just looking at some of the um, video here of, of habitat for humanity at work so you guys do more than just build homes I mean there's support services yeah, we do. So we've been around for 34 years. We actually just celebrated our 150th new home build two days ago. Congratulations. Um, which was a really big feat for us. Um, but we do, we also repair homes. That's a new program that we started about three years ago. So this year, in addition to our new home builds for low-income families, we'll also do about 50 home repairs for low-income seniors and veterans. And then we do neighborhood revitalization. So about three weeks ago, we had our Rock the Block event where that footage that was shown um, was from, and we had 400 volunteers come out over 36 hours and do 29 projects. So wow. uh, both home repair projects as well as um, community projects at the local community And everybody center. coming together, that's great. So tell us again about the event this weekend, where it is, all the info, and how can people get tickets? So the event is this Saturday, October 5th at Memorial Auditorium. We have probably about six tickets left for the entire event, so it's almost sold out, but <laughs> you can now. still snag those tickets. <laughs> um, you can go to habitatgreatersac.org slash gala. And is there a dress code? Because we talked about it being fancy. There is a dress code. It's a 21 and up event. Um, so those uh, very nice wines and fizz I mentioned earlier will be flowing liberally. So it is right. a 21 and over <laughs> event and uh, black tie. Wow. Um, now, if people can't go, because you said there's only six tickets left, how else can they get involved or if they want to donate, what should they do? There's no shortage of opportunity to get involved with Habitat. You know, our gala is one event out of, you know, a 365 day year. We uh, engage over 2,500 volunteers a year and we have projects, multiple projects going every single week. So if you're ever interested in volunteering as an individual, as a group, we do a women build in May. Um, 
there's also always opportunity to donate financially as an individual or a company to help support these really critical projects. Okay, and what's the website they should visit? HabitatGreaterSac.org. All right, Lane, best of luck this weekend. Sounds Thank like it's going to be a fun event, time to get dressed up, hair done, nails done, and it's all for a great cause. Yes. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you. This interview involves commercial content. The products and services featured appear as paid advertising.